Improving internet speed and fixing connectivity issues using PowerShell involves various techniques, from tweaking network settings to diagnosing and resolving network problems. Here are 7 PowerShell commands and scripts you can use to speed up and fix internet connection. Type PowerShell in the search tab and click Run as an administrator. Set DNS servers, setting specific DNS servers can sometimes improve internet speed and reliability. You can use the following commands to set DNS servers. Set DNS client server address, interface alias, Ethernet server addresses, eight dot eight dot eight dot eight. 8.8.4.4 Google's public DNS servers are known for their reliability and speed. By setting your computer to use these servers, DNS queries can be resolved more quickly compared to using potentially slower or less reliable DNS servers provided by your ISP. Faster DNS resolution means that domain names are translated into IP addresses more swiftly, resulting in quicker website loading times and improved overall internet speed. Change network adapter settings. You can use PowerShell to modify various network adapter settings, such as speed and duplex. Here's an example of how to set the speed and duplex of a network adapter. Set net adapter advanced property. Name Ethernet display name. Speed and duplex, display value, one hundred megabits per second full duplex. By manually setting the speed and duplex settings of the network adapter, you can ensure a stable and reliable connection. One hundred megabits per second full duplex configuration specifies a fixed speed of one hundred megabits per second and full duplex communication, allowing for simultaneous data transmission and reception. This can prevent issues such as packet loss, collisions, and network congestion that may occur with auto-negotiation or mismatched settings. Optimize TCP IP settings. You can tweak TCP IP settings to optimize network performance. Here's an example of adjusting the TCP receive window size. Set item property, path HKLM, backslash system backslash current control set, Backslash services backslash tpip backslash parameters name TCP window size value 64240. The TCP window size determines the amount of data that can be sent or received before receiving an acknowledgement from the receiving end. By adjusting the TCP window size, you can optimize data transfer efficiency, allowing for larger amounts of data to be sent or received in a single transmission. This can lead to improved internet speed, especially for high bandwidth applications such as file downloads or video streaming. Check network connection status. You can use the test connection complete to check if your computer can reach another device on the network, such as a router or a website. For example, type test connection computer name google.com. By targeting a specific website like Google, you can isolate whether the problem lies with your internet connection overall or if it's specific to accessing certain websites. This can help in troubleshooting and fixing internet-related issues more effectively. Flush DNS Cache Flushing the DNS cache can sometimes resolve DNS-related issues. Use the following command to do so. Clear DNS Client Cache The command clears the DNS client cache on your computer. This cache stores DNS records for recently accessed websites, allowing for faster access to them in the future. However, if outdated or incorrect DNS records are stored in the cache, it can lead to connectivity issues or slower internet speeds. By clearing the DNS cache, you ensure that your computer retrieves fresh DNS records from DNS servers, potentially resolving DNS-related issues and improving internet speed. Release and renew IP address. Releasing and renewing your IP address can sometimes fix connectivity problems. Use the following commands. IP protocol configuration slash release. When you release the current IP address assigned to your network interface, IP protocol configuration slash release, it effectively disconnects your computer from the network. 
IP protocol configuration slash renew. When you renew the IP address, IP protocol configuration slash renew, your computer requests a new IP address from the DHCP server on the network. This process can help resolve connectivity issues caused by an expired or misconfigured IP address, ultimately improving internet speed and reliability. Reset network stack. Resetting the network stack can sometimes resolve persistent network issues. You can do this with the following command. Netch Winsock reset. Resetting the Winsock catalog restores the Winsock settings to their default state. This action can undo any changes or corruption that may have occurred in the Winsock catalog over time, restoring the integrity of the networking stack. By reverting to a clean state, you can eliminate potential obstacles that may have been impeding internet connectivity or causing performance issues, thereby potentially improving internet speed and reliability.